Welcome to the Laravel Collections Guide. In this series, we take a look at each of the available methods in the Laravel Collection class and dive deep through examples in explaining what it does. Today, we're going to be looking at first where. First where is actually a combination method. It is actually just a where clause with the first after alls. So the first example I want to show you is simply that. Let's start building our collections. Let's return, collect, and let's get a new array going here. We'll say product apples price 50 let's copy that a couple of times we'll say pears bananas and finally coconuts now for price we'll keep them all at 50 except this last one maybe we'll say 80 so let's call where and then let's pass in price equals to 50 and let's get the results of that so of course we get three things back but if we only wanted the first instance of that, then we would tag along first, okay? So there we have it. Apples, obviously, is the first where the price is equal to 50. For convenience, first where can be used instead. So we'll say first where, and then let's run this, and sure enough, you get the exact same thing. So that is all that first where is. It is simply just an alias of calling the where method followed by the first. And this is something that you'll actually use quite often. You simply just want one item. You don't want a full collection. Now let's take a look at another example. And let's just say that we are looking for everything where the price is greater than or equal to 50. Okay. And sure enough, apples is still the same one. However, if we change this to maybe 70 coconuts here is the first instance where the price is greater than or equal to 70. Again, just to reiterate, that is simply just a where price is greater than or equal to 70 and then tag on the first. And of course, we get the same result. Let me bring that back. Let's change the collection a little bit. We're actually gonna say null. And then this one, let's say null as well. Let's rewrite this in long form. Where price, and then we can call the first on it. So all I want here is the first instance where there is a price. Obviously, we are looking for bananas. And let's check out the results. And perfect, we do get bananas. However, when you try to run this now in the shortcut version, first, where, let's see what happens. It actually blows up. So how do you fix this? Well, in Laravel 5.7, you have to pass in a second attribute it is required. A second attribute is required for first where. And if we run this, we're back to working. However, check this out. I'm going to jump over to my composer.json file and I'm running 5.7. I'm going to say dev master to bring in the latest cutting edge version of Laravel. Now, once Laravel 5.8 gets released, there's been an update to this particular method that I think you'll like the results of. So we'll say composer update and let's let that run. And there we go. We've brought in the latest version of Laravel. Let's go back to our example here, and I'm gonna remove the second parameter. Now remember, this did not work before. However, now, when we run that, we get the result that we expected. Now let me show you where that is. If we go over to the upgrade guide to 5.8, and you scroll down a little bit, in the collections method, here it is. In the first where method, you actually see this operator now has a default of null. So starting in version 5.8 and going forward, the first where method is not going to require a second parameter, allowing us to do something like this. Now, the last thing I do want to show you about first where is that unlike a lot of the other available methods, first where does not return an actual collection. It returns an item. You would not be able to tag this on. You would use this at the very end of a long chain of method calls.